guys, welcome back. I hope you're all doing good. I am back today to answer another one of your frequently asked baking questions. It's a very common one today, which is how do I convert plain flour to self-raising flour? To convert your plain flour into self-raising, you're going to need some baking powder. As a general rule, you want to add two teaspoons of baking powder to every 150 grams of flour. Mix it in really well and then sift it to make sure it's evenly distributed, otherwise your cake's going to rise all unevenly. Okay, well that sounds simple enough, but what if you don't have baking powder? Well you can actually make your own. All you need to do is combine one teaspoon of cream of tartar with half a teaspoon of bicarbonate of soda. And this makes the equivalent of two teaspoons of baking powder. Some people have asked me, can I use bicarbonate of soda instead of baking powder? Well, unfortunately not, unless your recipe specifically states to. The thing is with bicarb is that it's an alkali and it needs an acid in order for it to work. Hence why baking powder also contains cream of tartar, which is an acid. The acid and the alkali react together when liquid is added, producing carbon dioxide and forming air bubbles, which makes the cake rise. There's not really any other way in which you can make self-raising flour, so if you don't have any of these ingredients to hand, I would suggest that you find another recipe that uses plain flour instead. Otherwise, your cake's going to come out really flat and dense, which will be a little bit of a disappointment. And that's it, a very simple video today, but something I get asked a lot. So I really hope this one was helpful for you. If you liked it, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel so I can make more content like this and continue to share my business journey with you for my little cake shop here in the UK. And if you have a baking or business related question of your own, please do pop it in the comments below and I will more than happily answer it for you. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time guys. Bye.